I'm meteorologist Brad Souter, and this is WeatherWise, explaining today how to rate a tornado, how folks do it on the EF scale, EF0 to EF5. And as we look at that scale now, an EF0 would have winds of approximately 65 to 85 miles per hour. That is the weakest of tornadoes. And this is the sort of damage that you could possibly see with that. Some shingles missing, some limbs broken off from trees. Crews can assess how strong a tornado is by looking at the damage that it causes, not by the look of the actual tornado. EF1 of 86 to 110, crews would see roofs that do have some damage, some shingles blown off along with parts of the roof missing. That would get an EF1 rating, an EF2 rating, can have winds up to 135 miles per hour and can do considerable damage to homes. This home is partially collapsed. EF3 winds up to 165 miles per hour, can level a home, only interior walls will be standing, so crews will be able to look at the damage indicators and estimate how strong the winds are based how that looks. An EF4 winds up to 200 miles per hour, can do considerable damage, erase homes, erase neighborhoods, but it's really hard to prove the most monster of tornadoes up to an EF5. You have to have a well-built structure with bolts on the foundation uh, frame and it will sweep a home completely away. Nothing left. Looks like new construction there. Not even carpet or even tile left over. The tornado erases it all and will lift off the frame of the home with bolts that are secured to the foundation. I'm meteorologist Brad Souter.